Hey right. folks, thanks for coming to Largo. So this is the section. Please put your hands together for the section. Richard Ancello, Leah and Daphne, the beautiful ladies back here, who should be right up here. And this is Eric. And uh, if you like that, and uh, which of course you did, this is their album. It's called Strung Out on OK Computer. And we have it on sale at the door. And it's fantastic. I found it at Tower Records and uh, I knew a guy that knew a guy and I called up this guy and fucking boom. So uh, <laughs> they also have an, an album on Zepp, uh, stuff of Zeppelin on sale and the band Tool. I'm not joking, honest to God, it's on sale over there after the show. Ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for Soul Brother number one, Grant Lee Phillips. <laughs> kick this year evening off on my behalf here um, we felt like this might be the perfect opportunity to bring two worlds together you know the the classical world and 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 the, the derelict world that I, that I reside in and uh, so this is a special treat
I come from, we'd be saying, on the cello to rip out your intestinal wall. That's Richard on the cello. There he goes, there goes Richard. Thank you. Oh, that's the, the, the viola, I guess. The, the viola of rock and roller, my friends. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's, that's, yeah, yeah. And, and, and De- what are you playing there, Daphne? That's, that's the violin. <laughs> yeah. All right, jam and double dual lead, we call that. Dual lead, Eric, Daphne, thank you very much. <laughs> so I feel a whole lot classier just being among them. Don't you know 
brand new instrument. <laughs>
watching the clock over Jackson Square I can feel my life drifting away Losing my hold like the muddy banks In eleven straight days spring I better call on that same expertise I better call that saint expertise. I hung on the carousel, took me a while to see that it just goes round. I kept on thinking, your name rings a bell, you resemble someone when you smile. And I want to say it's that same. Expertise. Honey, you got a face like Saint Expertise. Spirit grows heavy to wonder at times what keeps it from floating up higher. The hatred of people that I might have crossed or the gravity of our desire. It's hell either way, calling saint expertise. It's hell either way, calling saint. Any good chanters? Dixie Drugstore. <laughs> uh, Too early? Any, well, I mean, that's that. I was asking for folks to kind of growl at a low, you know, that's, and that's more like a song selection. <laughs> We're reading the same book. We're just in different chapters. <laughs> Well, check it out. We've, we've got something on the range. We, we, we rehearsed once or twice. So. <laughs> Bellies in the trench 
Some new shoes I picked up in London, England. I don't know if I can kind of help me, Eric, if you can kind of say that. <laughs> yeah. So, part you know, it's a good reason to get here early, make your reservations early so you can check out things like this, which are like, this would be like an Easter egg if, or something if it was a digital token. You know? <laughs> Certain things that some of the folks back can't see, but I'm going to pass these shoes around and just, uh, <clears throat> just get them back to me at the end of the night. And, uh, so, anyway, a squirt or two. <laughs> yeah, okay, great. <laughs> I don't feel the difference personally. <laughs> I've been seeking affirmations of Lord, oh man, what I'm feeling in my heart can't be wrong. No, sir, I've been a splinter person, but I might have to do my love. Oh, but there ain't no to me back. I've been a splinter in this little hill, just like Clay's with the fuck you know. Oh, 
Channeling Robin Hitchcock for once. I was yeah yeah I got the whole yeah right Grant yeah <laughs> so Grant yeah like it's, what are we wow <laughs> it's see Robin is we think of him as being a man and a, and a person but he's a he's actually a spore in intelligence and <laughs> like spirulina but like in a man form. <laughs> He's a telepath. Um, let's see, where was I now? Ah, delving back into the oldies. With me, I don't know how, but I beg you to stay. Crawl around and listen, well, the world's still small. Honey, don't think about it too long now. Honey, don't think we lie. And help me heal these scars Could you learn to realize In the case of mine Do you read in the dark? Honey, don't think about it too long Honey, don't think Cause your life ought to figure me out Don't wanna figure me out Don't think, cause you're laughing, go and figure me out. 
And I don't think Cause your life won't figure me out Figure me out to chime in on this one here we can always we meaning uh me and uh whatever characters may be lurking under my hat <laughs> Uh, uh, could you could you crank up a uh, uh, 
want to crank up uh, some margaritas, maybe? <laughs> and uh, because it's a nice February 23rd, nice hot summer day, and uh, we could all use some margaritas. And uh, maybe a little bit of uh, extra re uh, echo. I like that too, a little echo. Yeah, yeah. Feel free to mix the two. That'd be great. <laughs> really, that's a buzz, I'm telling you. A little bit of echo in your own. Oh, yes. We were, we were doing a show, that's right. <laughs> kind of just, you know, I'm kind of liking it. I'm liking the elbow room, you know. I'm rather just, just trying to get in touch with me, you know, and all, and my, my needs. And, uh, a lot of it comes from Dr. Phil, I have to admit. I um, feel quite late and watch Dr. Phil, and uh, he puts ideas in my mind. <laughs> So I went and got the book, Dr. Phil book, and then uh, trying to do more reading, and I got that book, and I got uh, The Mothman, the other <laughs> book I'm reading. And I kind of go back and forth. And, uh, I, as far as I remember, I'm supposed to be getting in touch with my inner pupa. Uh, so my light bulb moment is like me on the porch, just fluttering. You know? <clears throat> um, yeah, so did we, did, did, did we get the echo going? Yeah, yeah, that's good. All right, great. See, I, I gave you plenty of time to run down to the guitar center and, and like, buy the thing. Yeah. <laughs> Spiralina, and uh, so it's an intelligence that's inside me that's taking hold of me, which is performing for you now and also.
kind of talking, talking a little bit of shit about the kitchen. <laughs> Sometimes you can't help it, you know. I, I try really hard not to be offensive. I could go out of my way. <laughs> I really do. Let's see here now. We were thinking, we were, I was going to do another song. You know? Let me check my list of songs. By now you notice this is probably a list of songs. Yes. Or or a prayer, maybe. Just say this to yourself and you'll be fine, my son. You will be fine. Um <clears throat> yeah, here's a song. reconcile it within myself that there's going to be, you know, there's going to be things that just, things in this world that aren't our cup of tea, you know, and perhaps I should elaborate. <laughs> and, uh, I don't know if any of you ordered tea this evening. <laughs> uh, you know, I had a 
dream. For instance, I mean, I, it always bites me in the ass whenever, whenever I go out on a limb and I'll, you know, walk that plank and kind of put forth some sort of opinion, which is like the job of a journalist or a critic or something like that. You know, I mean, I'll put forth my opinion on things that, uh, you know, uh, uh, plant life, alien life forms, things like this, things that matter. You know, and, uh, but, um, you know, but like I had this dream where um, I had this dream where somehow I walked into the Hollywood Palace. And it was it was like this, you know, it was such blackness. But on the stage, it was as though a miracle were, were being born. And the band Creed were playing. <laughs> <laughs> and, and I looked up there and it was though it was though the singer might have been like like one of those Paul Bunyan men by the roadside, you know, just straddling the stage and with the leather pants on and it was like, Do you take me higher? And it was it was like a Moses moment. It was, it was, and, and, and I don't want to, and I'm not bagging on the dudes. I mean, they're probably really sweet folks, and I know that I mean, they could even be here this evening. If you are, then I am sorry. I'm just a jerk. Just a jerk with a microphone. That's the only thing that separates me from other jerks at the moment. And, uh, and, and this, this sound went on, this yeah. And, uh, and, and it woke me up. It, it, it woke me up out of my sleep. And only to realize that what I was what I was translating was my neighbor was he had the tree trimmers and they were taking down a tree. <laughs> so in some ways I felt less guilty about bagging on the band, you know, because I mean some things aren't your cup of tea, and, and in, in this case it's on a par with total deforestation, apparently. <laughs> so, I apologize to the Creed man and wish him well. You guys hang in there. A little echo, please.
so much for being so attentive. Well, thank 
you so much. Honestly, honestly, I mean, I wouldn't be offended if you wanted us to go get a bite, maybe? Get the swingers? Um, you know, the, the restaurant, the swingers. Um, uh, don't hit swingers, I mean, they just folk swingers. Uh, gee, so, uh, well, it's a real pleasure to get to play for you, it honestly is. Every single time, especially this evening. Thank you. I mean, uh, can I have a little bit of echo in my voice again? That just makes me feel, I just feel like I'm in a safe place. <laughs> you know what it is, I hung out in caves when I was a child. <laughs> it really helps. That's <laughs> Speaking of offending people, I'm totally sticking my big fat foot in my mouth. Years and years ago when I had a sickness, um, I mean not like an extreme sickness, I just had like a bad flu or something, you know, and I was on the road. I was on the road and uh, it must have been in Barcelona, Barcelona they, they <laughs> and uh, I had like a 219 degree fever and uh, <clears throat> I'd just been in bed for days and days and days watching Sky News. <laughs> And, uh, and then I came down one morning, came on d down to the, the lobby one morning to do an interview, and, 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 the, uh, and the, the kind journalist said, the first thing out of his mouth, he said, so I think uh, maybe uh, you are very much uh, influenced by the simple minds. <laughs> <laughs> and I was just so taken back, and, and again, it wasn't so much me as it was the, the, the enzymes living within me that, that leapt up and said, why would you, what they, they suck dog shit. Why did you say that? And, and then I thought, what, what, what am I saying? And then, and then sure enough, I come back to America, right? I come back to America and I'm on the phone with my, with my brother actually. He says, he says, uh, hey, did you check out the, the, uh, the 120 minutes with the simple minds? They, they said that, that, that Grantley Buffalo totally inspired them to start making music again. <laughs> <laughs> so that's an example of my instant karma. I felt like a total idiot. And I don't know, I don't think I can ever make it up to the simple minds. No what I do. But um, if you would sing along with this song with me, this it's not a simple mind song, but it's <laughs> Can I have a little echo? It's as good as I can do. Into my heart, you see my soul sky, you know it stops. In the mind, it goes bang bang, bang, and I feel the same. But something's bugging you, there's something in your mind. A best friend told me what you did last night, you let me sleep in my bed. I was dreaming, should have been with you instead. You know the words, wake me up before you go.
they can dance, actually, that would be better if they dance. And you know the rest. to go dancing or he wants them to go dancing and then he's like well don't be cruel because I mean I'm like well what, what did she do she didn't say anything <laughs> she's your lady you're her fool I mean that's how it works I don't know I haven't totally got it all sorted out but... okay now here's a this so anyway here's a much 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 better song <laughs> Watch out now, take care, beware of fallen swingers. Dropping all around you. But pain that often mingles, it's your fingertips.
you chime in. Like a good neighbor. Oh, yeah. Oh, I had a screw. <laughs>
but, uh, but always acceptable here at Largo just to shout the names of uh, the obituaries. That's the great. <laughs> Chuck Jones! <laughs> See, I mean, it doesn't really accomplish much. <laughs> Monica, do you have that Warner Brothers record, the old, the old, uh, I mean, I know they made a lot of records, right? I mean, not really. <laughs> really, I would know that. I meant the cartoon songs. That's a good record. No, but that wouldn't be cool. You don't want to just, like, pay money to come to a show and then have them play records. That wouldn't be nice. That's something else. That's like a rave or something. <laughs> Actually, people pay a lot of, a lot of money to see that. I don't know which one it is. <laughs> it's like the grail that I've been trying to work it out for a long time. caravan on the way home. Where does one take it? Where does one leave it? Mm, maybe a place like this. Just a girl who can't say no. And a sweetheart on parole. Press named her Jupiter to 
bliss away Lucky so He's the boy who never cried When they lock him up inside Yet you nickname him her that you try Pull it tight In a stupid turn tear drop In a stupid turn tear drop She divined the radio She pushed the buttons off Shoot a shot She wondered about the fate of The little lovers in the barrio She forget how to turn alive When she tuned in on the time With Jackie Wilson's long and lonely tear drop She's sleeping in her bed Yeah, she's sleeping in her bed And it's cheaper to her and tear to her Walk together down the aisle With the world we live in so near And it's built on shooting eyes